100 B-21 Raider Stealth Bombers coming soon this year. After a long wait, 2022 will be the year that the B-21 Raider finally makes its first appearance. The B-21, developed by the US Air Force along with Northrop Grumman, is moving along with what seems like a rapid research and development phase. The first two were completed earlier this year, with many more to come. Five of the jets are believed to be in production currently at Air Force Plant 42 in California. According to Defense News, the B-21 will be rolled out to the public in 2022, although the exact date of its arrival is undetermined. The first flight of the new stealth bomber is also planned for some time in 2022. Whenever it is unveiled, the B-21 will be the first new Air Force bomber since the B-2 Spirit Bomber in 1988 to make its debut. Frank Kendall, the Air Force Secretary, said earlier this month that the general public might not get a close look at the Raider right away. We don't want to give our enemies a head start on any of this, Kendall said on a December 9th panel, per Defense News. We're going to acknowledge that we're doing this, let the public be aware, let the Congress be aware of it. But we're not going to say a lot more about what we're doing in the public. Defense One also noted that when the next fiscal year defense budget request arrives, it will likely provide some clues about the B-21 and also about what other programs might lose some funding. Earlier this year, the Center for a New American Security, CNAS, issued a report arguing the Air Force needs many B-21 bombers. The Pentagon is expected to ultimately acquire 100 of them, but the CNAS report argued for more than that, recommending at least 164, in order to be up to the task of a war with Russia or China. When considering theoretical requirements of up to 200-plus bombers to prosecute a penetrating strike mission against a great power such as Russia or China, it is better to err on the side of caution and maintain a healthy complement, 24, of backup and attrition aircraft, the report authors, Jerry Hendricks, CNAS Director of Defense Studies and Air Force Lieutenant Colonel James Price, wrote. Chris Osborne, an acclaimed national security expert and editor, wrote back in August about the B-21 and its breakthrough levels of stealth. This is based on its look, as well as other factors of what we know about the jet. The B-21 bomber does look like a B-2 bomber in a more general way, yet it is potentially much stealthier, Osborne wrote. The engine inlets, for instance, appear much more conformal and blended into the body of the aircraft, unlike a B-2 bomber where they protrude slightly above the wing. 